Italian America's Cup challengers Luna Rosa confirm $109 million sponsorship. Italian America's Cup challengers Luna Rosa confirm $109 million sponsorship. Italian America's Cup challenger Luna Rosa have confirmed a massive $109 million sponsorship for the next event. The Negation 65 meters sponsorship comes from Fashion House Prada, their long-term supporter, and will be paid over four installments through to 2021 when the event is scheduled to be raced in Auckland. The huge sponsorship confirms the level of intent from the Italians who are the challenger of record, working alongside America's Cup holders Emirates Team New Zealand to shape the 36th edition of the regatta. Luna Rosa signed on as the challenger of record within seconds of Team New Zealand's Cup clinching race over Oracle Team USA in Bermuda last June. The sponsorship of Luna Ross's participation in the America's Cup is in line with the company's communication strategy to promote the Prada name and brand, Prada confirmed in a statement. The company has taken into account many factors, including the size of the competition and the expected amount of press coverage of the competition, which will attract massive attention all around the world and tremendous press coverage from both the traditional ones and the new technologies media. The sponsorship will include participation in led-up events they indicated were planned for New Zealand, the United States, Asia and Europe. Prada's chief executive officer and executive director Patrizio Bertelli also heads the Luna Rosa syndicate. Luna Rosa were instrumental in seeing the America's Cup return to Manaholes after three editions of racing in multi ulls They sat out the last America's Cup, frustrated at Oracle constantly tweaking the rules. They have shared information and technology with Team New Zealand for the 2013 and 2016 regattas. Prada have also replaced Louis Vuitton as naming rights sponsors for the Challenger Series to be sailed in Auckland that will now be known as the Prada Cup. The official entry period for the America's Cup opened on January 1 but the Royal New Zealand Yachts Squadron have yet to confirm any teams. Luna Rosa, Britain's Ben Ainsley Racing and the New York Yacht Club have all previously confirmed they will be sailing in the event. Team New Zealand designers continue to work on the details of the new 75-foot foiling monoholes with the class rule set to be revealed on March 31. That is expected to generate increased interest from potential syndicates. Auckland City and New Zealand government officials are still working through the logistics for the America's Cup Village with two options on the table. The plans cover bases for eight syndicates. They need to confirm Auckland's intent by the end of August or risk losing the event to Italy.